Hello bakers and welcome back to another episode of Behind the Bake Off. Now sorry this episode is slightly late but as you can probably tell by the new kitchen I've just moved house. Now most of my stuff is still in boxes but I've managed to unpack just enough to bring you this week's episode. Now if you missed last week's technical challenge of the Viennese Worlds, the link for that is down below. But this week the contestants were asked to make a batch of damp noodle. The damp noodle is a German sweet steamed bun. And as Mary Berry said, it's quite like a British ice bun, without the icing. Now this is one of the recipes that I've never tried before, but it's quite a fun experiment playing around with Paul Hollywood's recipe as I tried it for the first time. For the dough, pour 500 grams of strong white flour into your mixing bowl. Add in 100 grams of caster sugar, 7 grams of fast action dried yeast, 150 milliliters of milk, 2 large eggs, and 70 grams of melted butter. You can either mix this by hand, or, as I've done, use a stand mixer. Knead the dough for 5 minutes, and then add in the zest of 1 lemon. Place the dough into a lightly greased bowl, cover with cling film, and then leave to rise for at least an hour. While the dough is rising, you can make your plum sauce. For the sauce, I've placed 4 roughly chopped plums into a saucepan. Add in the juice of 1 orange, 50 grams of demerara sugar, and then bring to the bowl for 5 to 10 minutes. Once the plums have softened completely, take off the heat and add in some cinnamon. Allow it to cool slightly and then blend until you get a smooth, thick sauce. You can also make the vanilla sauce. For this, I've heated 150 milliliters of milk, 150 milliliters of double cream on a saucepan over a low heat. In a separate bowl, whisk three egg yolks with half a teaspoon of vanilla, two teaspoons of plain flour and 50 grams of caster sugar until pale and fluffy. Pour in your hot milk, whisking continuously to make sure you don't get scrambled egg. Once combined, return to the heat and then simmer for 4 minutes until thickened. Set your sauce aside to cool, covering with cling film to make sure it doesn't form a skin. Once your dough has doubled in size, turn out onto a lightly floured surface. Knock the air back and then divide the dough into 12 pieces and roll them into balls. I've used the dumpling technique, pulling the outside into the middle to give it a nice smooth finish. To make the poaching liquid, heat 25 grams of unsalted butter, 150 milliliters of milk, and 25 grams of caster sugar in a large saute pan for five minutes. Add the dough balls into the liquid and then leave to stand for 15 minutes until doubled in size again. Cook the damp noodles on a low heat with the lid on for 25 minutes. At this point, you should be able to remove the lid and allow them to cook for a further five minutes until the bases are nice and golden. And you're done! These damp noodles are ready to serve with your freshly made sauces. So there you go! Not bad for a first try and they tasted pretty good as well. If you haven't made them before, give them a go and let me know what you think in the comments below. That's all for this week's episode of Behind the Bake Off. If you enjoyed it, make sure you subscribe and I'll see you next week. Damp, damp noodle, dum 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 dum. Damp, damp noodle, dum 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 dum.